Are you looking for a resistant band exercise on keto? Well, stay tuned to the end of this video because I'll be showing you my resistant band exercise to get a well-toned body. Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Rosario and I am a nutrition coach and best-selling author here in New York City and my mission is to inspire you to become the healthiest version of yourself by using the power of nutrition and keto and all of the equipment that I'm gonna be using will be linked down in the description if you guys want to check that out all right let's get started our first exercise we're gonna be doing is a banded squat for this exercise we're gonna step inside of our band and put it in the middle of our foot and we're gonna stand a little bit shoulder apart as you can see our toes are pointing away from each other now keeping our back straight and our chest out we're gonna bring our band to our shoulders like this and we're gonna go slowly down and up like this Now we will do 20 reps and four sets of this one. All right, I want you to take your time doing this one because it's important that you don't rush it because it's meant to build your body, not to do as quickly as possible. All right, let's do it. Our second exercise is a stiff leg deadlift with the band so let's do it our first step is to put the band in the floor like this and we're gonna step into the band shoulder width apart and we're gonna grab the end of our band keeping our knees bent like this chest up and back straight keeping your chest up like this will make it easier for you to know that your back is straight so you will pull up like this and up. Pull up your band and down. You will feel your hamstring stretching. All right. All right. We will do four sets of this one and 20 reps in each. All right. Let's do it. Our third exercise is banded push-up. So I'm using a different band because the other one doesn't stretch enough for me. So I am gonna put it around my back and I am gonna tie it to my hands like this. Now that my hands are tied, I should have a little bit of tension like this, All right? So let's do it. And we're gonna get into a push-up position and we're gonna keep our back straight and our arms should only bend at the elbows, like this. We're gonna do 20 reps and four sets of this one, all right? Let's do it. Our fourth exercise will be a bent over row. So let's do it. First, we're gonna step into our band and we're gonna stand shoulder width apart. We're gonna bend our back and we're gonna grab our band right about under our knees and we're gonna pull with our back to our waist like this. So a tip that I use is not don't grab it with your hands like this, grab it like a hook, like you're hooking the band. So I am hooking the band and pull it up. We're gonna do 20 reps and four sets of this one. All right, let's do it. Our fifth exercise will be a shoulder press. So let's get started. For the shoulder press, we're gonna hold our band with one feet 
and our hand like this. We're gonna pull our band to our chest here and we're gonna push up. Also, we're gonna do this for both arms. So after you do your right or left arm, you're gonna go to your other arm and do the same, right? We're gonna do 20 reps and four sets for each arm. So let's get started. Now that we worked out all of our main groups of muscle in the body, we're gonna do our only isolation exercise, which is banded hammer curls. Let's do it. For hammer curls, we're gonna step into a band, like this, shoulder width apart, and we're gonna hold our band like this, like you're holding a hammer, or you can do it like this, so like doing it like this, you're holding a hammer, all right? You're going to keep your chest you're gonna hold your band and you're gonna curl. You're gonna do 20 reps and four sets of this one. All right? Let's do it. You guys, a quick tip on all of these exercises. To work your core, you just gotta keep your core tight in every single exercise. When you are coming up in the squat, or when you are Pulling in the deadlift, you want to keep your core tight. That will work your abs. You don't really need to do ab workouts for your abs to show. All right. And I have a question for you guys. What is your favorite workout routine? Let me know down in the comments, please, because I would like to try it. And if I like a workout routine that I try, I might make a video on it. So let me know down in the comments. And if you guys want to check any equipment that I use throughout this video, all of that it will be linked down in the description if you want to check that out. If you found this video helpful and you found value in this video, hit the like button because I will really appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button because you don't want to miss when I post weekly video like this one where I provide value to you guys and help you become the healthiest version of yourself using the power of nutrition and keto. See you guys in the next video. I love all of y'all.